Yep, Lucas Oil Stadium, Kevin Bowen checking in. Colts had a really spirited practice, intense, physical, some live tackling on Monday. Um, takeaways, the run game, terrific. They kind of had a scrimmage feel, like an actual halftime. And uh, Marlon Mack in the run game really took off after uh, the halftime. Uh, some huge holes on both sides of the line there for that unit. And uh, probably the most highlight-filled day for Mack after Jonathan Taylor had a big one last week. Um, Jacob Eason, the most extended work we've seen for the rookie here in 11-on-11 11 11 throwing. He was 5 of 9, which isn't eye-popping, but he threw the ball much better than those stats indicate. He had a couple drops, um, you know, on ball, the ball's on target. It, it, the ball just comes out of his arm uh, at a different velocity than a lot of quarterbacks, and you can see that rawness there. Obviously a lot to work with and a lot that still needs to be developed, but a good day for Eason considering we don't see any preseason reps for him. Lastly, Ben Banigou, Tyquan Lewis, two second rounders that really need good camps. Both of them had good practices today. Lewis continues to impress day after day. Banigou, a couple nice pass rushes off the edge. Unfortunately, he got hurt, an ankle injury. Uh, Frank Wright doesn't think it'll be too serious. So off day on Tuesday for the Colts. Then uh, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, their final four days of camps. Uh, full padded in front of the media, and they'll be at Lucas Oil again on Saturday. 107 by the fan.com, all your hopes content.